Major news today, Nebraska lawmakers giving final approval to a bill that repeals the death penalty. The vote, 32-15, that is enough to override a promised veto from Governor Pete Ricketts. Today we spoke to the mother of a victim whose daughter's murderer is still on death row. She says the people there deserve to be put to death. Yes, every last one of them deserved it, not just mine. All of them. They did terrible, terrible, heinous things. Otherwise, they wouldn't be there. Melissa's daughter, Amber Harris, disappeared in November of 2005. Her body was found in May of 2006. Roy Ellis, a convicted sex offender, was charged in her death. Senator Ernie Chambers supports the bill and says its approval makes his time in office worth something. I could not have done it alone. I tried 40 years and was unable. So with all the other things I'd done in the legislature, had this not achieved, I would have felt my whole tenure here to have been a failure. Governor Pete Ricketts will likely veto the decision. But again, today's votes are enough to override that veto.